here we are with Fairy Lit's November box and a wet doggy. <laughs> Shall we open it up? Okay, okay, okay. Here we are. Oh, <laughs> stuff is jumping out already. Ah, uh, this looks very cool, whatever it is. What do you smell? <laughs> so you're very interested in the shelf. Well, uh, I can't see the like leaflet yet of like what everything is. So <laughs> she's wanted out my room already. Come see what this is. What is this? Uh, I have no idea what this could be. Like what book it's from or what it is even. It seems to be something you can hang on the wall. But it doesn't seem quite like a banner. Because it seems more like you can put stuff in it. Is it just like a... Uh, oh, here we go. Ah, this makes much more sense. Uh, so yeah, it's kind of like... Something you can put up on your wall and like put stuff in. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what is it? I know that this is pretty designs, but this is really lawn uh, and not quite my style so it is cool I want to I need to find out what book this is but yeah I definitely don't think I'll be using this okay <laughs> cool as she's not in a <laughs> vloggy kind of <laughs> mood today so I'll let her out and continue opening okay so on to the next item oh already a calendar oh cool uh i'm gonna open this i guess okay i've opened the other item but i just found out this item is from like the book of the month uh i, I don't know i feel kind of weird about that like it's really big for a book most people won't have read yet and i think it's probably really relying on you liking the design which as i like the pattern it's just like I think if this was a different colour, maybe like a teal, like it looks like something you could hang up in your bathroom because there's quite a lot of kind of water, but the brown definitely puts me like off ever putting this up, unfortunately. Ah, uh, but yeah, we'll see this item, which is really cool. So yeah, if you kind of didn't see the box, it's kind of based on Sarah J Mass is a calendar. I don't know if that's how you say her name. I've actually not read any books by her yet. I've been meaning to read A Court of Thorn and Roses for ages and hopefully next year will be my year of that. But I always love the characters. Well, <laughs> off he goes. Uh, get to the side, so. I don't know who any of these are, but we'll see. My birthday month is August, so let's see who I am. Oh, here we go. Okay, so that's actually really nice so on the back. You don't have the calendar part so this is really cool that you can like display these after these months wow gorgeous oh wow his eyes are very piercing it's really cool wow. i love seeing them like in because obviously that kind of obstructs the view and then seeing them like this very cool She's gorgeous. Oh, hello. Oh, so this is me. Uh, is that Wednesday hell? Do you look kind of cool? I'm I'm satisfied with my August one. I. I'm not sure, but I think, I guess, and that's Crescent City because it's more modern. Could be Ron. Is that Crescent City as well? I'm not sure. He's cool. And then, Amber. So, 
So this is what it comes with. I don't know if you're supposed to display on here, I'm guessing. Uh, I will say I haven't read like any of these books. So I don't think I'm going to display like this. Uh, for my calendars, I like to use my calendars as like to remember what's happened each day. I don't really want to display it just like this. But I'm actually really happy with this side of the cards. Like I'm definitely going to keep it and just like... Maybe once I read the books, oh, my light's going crazy in here, it's flashing. Uh, like I read the books, maybe display some of the characters or just enjoy the artwork. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, I'll fix my light and then go into the next stuff. Okay, so the next item is one of those secret book things. Uh, so I have like my other one on my shelf there. I really like this last design. That I quite like the first one as well but we'll see what this is like hmm, see if I like it okay I'll open it up so yeah here we are I was hoping it wasn't going to be the color of the box because I kind of already am like hmm, yeah I am not too fond of this it is cool saying advanced alchemy I think they're all really cool it's just such a good idea just to like <laughs> put on your shelf and keep like all your items in but this is a I can like appreciate the design for sure. I think it's just the colour that immediately puts me off. But even that, I feel like this would be so good for like a prop as well, like if you're cosplaying or something and you don't want to carry a real book around, like this would be like amazing. But yeah, I'm not like, I think this is one I'm not going to keep unfortunately. So I like my one up there. Okay, uh, let's see the next thing. I... Okay, I am gonna figure out what book this is. So let's see. Let's see all the other things. Uh, Lanyard, Vampire Academy. I don't think this is a book I'm going to read at all. And so I don't get this, and it's not my style again. There's a lot of items I think that it's like, it's just not my style. This box, unfortunately. Uh, let's see. What is this? What? An, an extra item? Oh, so you get an ID case and a lanyard. Uh, that's... That's like an alright design. Like, it is similar, but I kind of appreciate this a bit, bit more. Again, it's probably not one I'm going to use, unfortunately. Yeah, it's not been great for items, like this bit box. Uh, okay, so... That's the book, but we've got the tarot cards, so here we are. Oh, I really like her. What book is this? So, it's a... Uh, These Violet Delights, oh, okay. Yeah, these are really cool. So I really like her. I'm like, can I like you? So yeah, I, I'm so glad I got like this box with the tarot cards. I just, I love them so much. And yeah, hopefully it'll be worth it. Cause I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep the book. To be fair, I'm, I'll open it and just see. So here we go. I'll put the phone down. Okay. Uh, you can see a little sneaky like <laughs> preview there, but. The book of the month is The Scarlet Alchemist and as you can see here it's a redesigned cover and like all the extra things it has and this is the original and I'm actually really impressed with the redesign so I'll go to it right now. Look how gorgeous that is. Like, there's so much detail in this. Like, like no offence to that one but if I'd seen that I would... I don't think I'd really pick up this book, like, oh, <laughs> low battery. Uh, it, I don't know, it's a really pretty, like, outfit and design and headpiece and stuff, but it's just that I would ignore that book. But if I saw this one, I would definitely be like, ooh, like, what is this book about? So, yeah, I am really impressed by that. Uh... So we'll see the edges. So it goes under here. And yeah, it's basically just the redesign cover. So that is gorgeous. Like I am 
I'm very, very impressed. And see, oh wow, they look really cool. That's really pretty artwork as well. Mm -hmm. So is she the main character? I'm guessing. It's the same one. And I did see this was like, I can't tell if that's a real signature. Mm. I think it might not be. Let's just double check. A uh, digital signature, yeah. Unfortunately. I know there's a big debate about the signatures. I actually would wish like they never did digital signatures because I like to think maybe one day I'd meet the like offer and I can get it signed. And if it's already got that, then it's kind of like, what's the point? Like I have like, I met Cassandra Clear recently and I had all my other like versions of Swordcatcher that I would actually prefer to get signed. And, but they all had a digital. So it just meant kind of like, well, I'll get the one that doesn't even have a digital. Yeah, I'll stop ranting about signatures. So here is the back. So, isn't it? It's still really cool. Oh, we new characters or same characters, different outfits. Can't tell. Let's see. I oh, know they look a bit different. Yeah, they're different. They're different. Just blank in the back. <laughs> hmm. So that is really cool. I really, I do look good. <laughs> and I guess this is in character. So yeah, I am pretty impressed with this redesign. I will think about keeping this book. <laughs> So the story didn't really interest me too much, but I'm really impressed by this redesign. Like, I, I really do love it. It's very pretty. Uh, so yeah, overall, this book box, like, I get... I'm happy I got it. Like, I have... I've seen this at least really cool redesign. I can choose whether to keep it or not. I got my tarot cards. I just love the tarot cards. And yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep these and oh, I should focus on them because I do love the art. Like I'm really impressed. Like this is absolutely gorgeous. But yeah, I'm not really happy of anything else. It's just nothing. None of this is really me. I'm definitely not going to use them all. Like these, like what? What the official name for them? I can't remember. It's like it's just secret box, I guess. Oh, magical tomes. Uh, I just feel like I need one personally. I don't feel I need more. Like I'm gonna keep my like money and maybe like a few precious items and stuff, but I don't need more than one. So I'm happy with that. If I ever get a pink one, maybe I'll then sell like that one on. But it's actually really cool. It says the Book of Fate. Like I do really, really love that. So, well, maybe if I get a pink one, I'll keep both. <laughs> but yeah, like I don't feel I need like tons of those. Uh, yeah, I'm... I'm still happy. I still feel this is maybe maybe one of my least favourite fairy loot boxes of the year. I, yeah, it's definitely probably in the top three least. Not sure my very least. I am so I'm pretty impressed by the redesign, so that kind of bumps up. Uh, but yeah, that's all. So, <laughs> see you next month.